Ever wondered what could make electric cars even better? Get ready to find out. Today, we're diving into a game-changing innovation that's shaking up the world of electric vehicles. Cattle, the world's largest battery maker, has just unveiled something incredible. What is this battery? And what makes this new battery so special? Let's explore how it's set to revolutionize electric cars in 2024. KTL, the largest battery manufacturer globally which supplies Tesla, Mercedes and BMW with batteries, has just created a new and stunning battery. The quick charge capability of this battery to 80% capacity in less than 10 minutes could result in a complete rethink of how electric vehicles are being operated. KTL's new battery uses an existing technology with the fundamental idea of improving it, which is different from most other new concepts that are thought of at startup companies. This cathode material is also known by its abbreviation LFP, or lithium ion phosphate. The LFP battery, a newly developed battery which is an improved version of existing battery, resolves major drawbacks of charging speed and safety. LFP batteries are widely accepted in the electric car world thanks to their lower price, enhanced performance and higher safety level. The biggest reason why so many people in big car companies like them is that they are so green. Now we are going to delve deeper into it. LFP batteries, unlike other kinds of batteries, have a proven track record of being very fire resistant, which makes them smart choices. KTL, the company that produces these batteries, has considered making some improvements to eliminate the most important issues of the LFP batteries, which is a great improvement for the electric car sector. Now, we shall reflect on the question of what this implies to Tesla, the biggest client of KTL. What is the characteristic of this new battery compared with other types, and which cars will adopt it in 2024? KTL's latest battery called Shenxing derives its name from the Mandarin words for fast and simple. This battery charges really fast, and its chemistry is based on the cheaper and safer LFP. This could lead to an even greater adoption of electric cars by consumers. At the moment, most electric vehicles are powered by lithium-ion batteries with the cathode made of a mixture of nickel, manganese and cobalt NMC. These batteries are remarkable for a fast charging and offering up to 270 watt hour per kilogram, which is the most energy in a small space. However, the NMC batteries are also having many issues. Besides nickel and cobalt, they need these metals mainly from tricky countries to work with, like Russia and Congo. This will result in a shortage of the necessary materials, and it's a great worry. In addition, NMC batteries get too hot at times, and thus lead to fires. This is what it's called thermal runaway, and it is a serious threat to these batteries. Besides, we'll come to notice that the NMC batteries do not last as long as we may like. They frequently stop to be used after 1,000 to 2,000 charging cycles, which is about 10 years or 250,000 miles on the road. They will next be able to only keep approximately 80% of their initial storage. However, the fine thing is that they're quite durable and hold up well even after the constant cycle. On the other hand, other types of lithium-ion batteries may outperform them by lasting even longer. To illustrate, a typical LFP battery can deliver 10,000 charging cycles before it begins to show significant signs of deterioration. It means the lifespan of the Model Y, which is the car with the LFP battery, can extend up to more than 1 million miles. Besides, Elon Musk has mentioned that the iron is very plentiful on Earth and can be mined in large quantities. It is because of this that EVs can be made more competitive and environmentally friendly for mass use by maintaining their affordability for common people. ARK Invest, the investment firm that has declared its opinion in favor of LFP batteries, believes that the production of LFP cells today is cheaper and likely to become more cost-effective in the future than NMC cells. As of now, LFP battery costs stand at around $170 per kilowatt hour, which is about 30% lesser compared to NMC batteries. This price advantage, coupled with the current market share of LFP batteries, which is 33%, and its growth to about 47% by 2026, gives them an edge over others, thereby making them an attractive and economical choice for electric vehicle manufacturers. And now for the main question, how did KTL attend this revolutionary breakthrough? They did it by improvising the three most important things. By the way, each cell of a battery, whether it be LFP, NMC or NCA, is composed of some parts. There are two electrodes called the anode and the cathode on one side and an electrolyte solution and a separator between them on the other. The separator is of course the most crucial component as it holds the anode and cathode apart. 
it ensures that the fingers do not touch and hence create a short circuit. The electrolyte will transport the lithium ions in the battery during charging and discharging processes. After these ions arrive at a new electrode, they are stored within graphite's lattice. And this is the exact spot where KTL found its way to a big success. Instead of using the old design of electrodes inside the battery, they came up with new methods. This change facilitated them to extend the surface area a lot, whereas the cell could still last a long time. This is in fact a spot-on feature because it enhances the performance of the battery. The name of KTL's technology is isotropic. It is the same whether you turn your head to the left or to the right. Consequently, lithium ions can get into the graphite in any direction and thus can move through it. This in return helps the battery to take the ions in quickly, easily and more efficiently. With this invention, batteries will charge faster, but that is not all that is improved. The company also led the way in improving lithium ions speed, which results in the batteries being charged up faster as well. These innovations have made this technology a fast charging giant in the new era. Now it can be refilled in 15 minutes and it can go up to 430 miles. Furthermore, because the battery charges faster, it is able to power things up at the same time. This is quite different from electric cars, with this new LFB battery achieving record-breaking acceleration. Nevertheless, even in this case, the fact of the matter is that how well the battery works and how long it lasts is still dependent on the temperature. Low temperatures below negative 1 degrees or 14 degrees Fahrenheit are hard for LFB cells, and they can also overheat when pushed to the limits. They serve best for ordinary situations. Another new kind of battery design is Keelin, whose structure is similar to Tesla's 4680 structural battery. Each cell is consequently inserted directly into the pack, and it has an integrated system which ensures the battery is functioning properly. This implies that they don't have to process the modules, which are hence more efficient and compact. The fact that battery packs are complete units and not separate cells would be very helpful to manufacturers because it would make building electric cars much more convenient. It is also the case that cost would be reduced. The current version of Keelin 3.0 battery pack is well designed with volume efficiency of 72%. This is even better than the 4680 battery produced by Tesla, which is really efficient at a rate of 63%. As a result of this, the entire battery pack is lighter and works more efficiently so cars can travel further with the same amount of energy. As to prevent the battery from overheating, KTL integrated a specialized liquid cooling system between the cells. This contrasts with the current design used in most batteries, which allows heat to be transferred away much better. Additionally, such a cooling function allows for the battery to charge super quick even in just 10 minutes. Therefore, what is the expected production date of that fantastic battery and which car models will it be in? That's what everyone's wondering. The initial company to use the Keelin battery was the Cattle, owned by a Chinese manufacturer. With the upgraded C-Car 001 model, they were able to drive over 600 miles on a single charge. Now, other Chinese brands like Avatar are also using this battery. But don't worry, the battery will also be made in Germany and Hungary, so more electric car companies can use it too. We're not sure if Tesla will use this battery yet, but it seems like they might, since they are KDL's biggest customer. And that's it, we have taken a peek into the future of electric cars. With the KDL WFB 2.0 battery, Cattle is leading the way to a cleaner, more efficient world. Stay tuned for more exciting updates as we keep moving towards a brighter, greener future on the roads.